Okay. It's always Canyon Network. <laughs> yeah, I've noticed uh I've noticed that there are definitely a lot of crowd favorites in terms of the maps. Like I you know, I I've, I'm starting to get used to seeing uh um you know, when I see them pop up as options, I just click them because I know everybody else is going to click them. So I guess I'm part of the problem. <laughs> By the way, welcome. Um, oh. Catold. That's how, yeah. I probably butchered that, so I apologize. But thank you. Thank you for joining. Are you a, uh, are you a player of the, of the Mech Warrior? Okay. Are you ready? Get your map multiplier up. Yep, there you go. I was wondering how that worked. So I think I figured it out. So it, 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 I'm guessing the multiplier goes up every time you pick something that is not picked by the group, right? Online. Regular MechWare online player. Online. So not online. not this one. This is so. Is there a, is there a different one? All systems nominal. This is Solaris Seven. So this is gonna be pretty embarrassing. If you if you're if you're pretty experienced with this game, then then you're gonna see some some sad uh, sad mech warrior play. But I'm getting better. <laughs> Been doing it for the last oh regular. Okay, I got gotcha. you. <clears throat> so so I would say then if you've been playing for three years, you're doing pretty good. How um, how much has the microtransaction-y aspect of this game affected you? Like, do you feel, like, I don't know if you've spent real money on the game or not, but do you feel that if you don't spend real money that you still get a, a full gaming experience? Because so far, for me at least, it, it does feel kind of like that's the case. Never spent any money on it? Well, that's, that's encouraging, actually. Because I... I don't like to spend money like at all. So, okay, we're in kind of a scary situation here. Whoops! Let me just shoot at the wall. Oh, well, this is gonna be a quick match. Oh, it's gonna be a short one. <laughs> Still super framey too. I don't know what that's about. Oh boy. Well, I promised I promised sad mech warrior play, so I delivered. <laughs> Microtro Jacksons to me are pretty much limited to cosmetics only, and even for that, you get sufficient stuff through events and such. Oh, that's cool. So there are other ways to uh, to kind of gain uh, gain some of those uh, non basic things. That's pretty cool. Because the, the one thing that has annoyed me so far is that when it comes to the cosmetics, like, you literally have, uh, like, five colors available, and they're all the same drab uh, uh, shade of purple. And it costs you, like, millions of sea bills to paint your mech. Like, way less than it costs for, like, a, ma a weapon of mass destruction that you slap onto the mech. So that was a so that was a, probably one of my worst performances, by the way, too. Um, so let's see, what do we got? So the, the the night gear I was I was saying earlier, the night gear is the mech that I've purchased, and it's not bad, but it lacks heavily in customizability. Uh, it's only got ballistic hard points. You rack up MC a lot in some of the regular events, so that's pretty cool. So can you can you participate in the event in the events um, in quick play mode, or it is is it these other three up here? The, like the faction play and the competitive play and all that kind of stuff. Because I am definitely not good enough to to play in any of those ones. Not yet, anyway. I'm getting there. 
one of these days. Any regular quick play match counts? Oh, well, that's that's very cool. I'm excited about that then. Let's take... Uh, so we're going to take a... Um, we're going to take one of the trial mechs out here. Let's try the catapult. We haven't done the catapult in a while. If you press the E button at the bottom center, you see the current event. Bottom center. Bottom center. Future events. Okay. Oh, wait. Active events. Payback event. Ends in eight days. There's premium time and a few million C bills in, in it this time. Okay. Uh, I can claim this. All right. Earn 10 Lance Information Awards. Earn 30 Protected Proximity Awards. Let's claim that. We got a million C bills. One days of active premium time. Cool. Wow. I don't think I would. I thought it was just a logo. I didn't. <laughs> I, I would have never thought to click on that. Uh, what else can we get here? So it looks like earn 25 scouting rewards, get more sea bills. Uh, let's see, earn five savior kills, earn 250 AMS missile destroyed. Well, I've got 41, so I guess my AMS is working. That's good. Good to know. Oh, sneaky, sneaky. 10 flanking rewards, earn 10 hit and run rewards. I'll take it. What do we get? 200 MC. Wow. Okay. What else? We redeemed that. Oh, it just repeated. Okay. Oh, well, that's neat. I'm learning. Learning already. So what's coming up in the future here? So, so that's just something I, I should be, I should be checking regularly. Very cool. Okay, so the my night gear's still in the in the match, so let's let's take out the catapult. Let's see if we can do a little bit better here. There's pretty much always an event on like that. Well, that's that's uh, very cool. Actually, you know, it, and and that kind of lends credence to what I was saying before about this game, which is that f at least for me, like that that whole aspect. Um, like it seems like I, I I feel like I'm not really missing much by not spending real money on the game. Um, it just it it's it's slow going, but I mean it's fun regardless. And um, you know I, I know that eventually if I keep playing I'll be able to get some some cooler mechs and stuff, or at least more mechs. I don't mind the night gear. It's just I wish that I could customize it a little bit better. So I think we've got time for one or two more matches here uh, before I have to return to the, the world of adulting. And I do like to, I, I love that they uh, swap out the trial mechs and stuff uh, periodically. I think that that's a really nice touch. It allows you to kind of keep playing and, and check out different things without, you know, while you wait to build up your your own little lance here uh i don't think i've ever played on terra therma and it looks like i'm not gonna oh they really they haven't oh is it from like because it seemed like i think there were different ones um, a couple days ago, but is, is it's usually like the same pool of of mechs that they switch around. I mean, either way, it's still. Oh, okay. They're planning to switch them currently. I don't mind the mechs they have. I think they're they're good starter mechs for sure. You know, they give you a good feel for the game. And quite frankly, uh, when I have even one more mech that I own, I probably won't use them anymore. Because really, it seems like any game that uh, a mech gets stuck in after I die is over by the time I get through a second match. <clears throat> I 
All right, we're collecting maximum resources this time. We didn't do too bad on the last conquest. I have a whole account on which I only use trial max. Oh, okay. So you have multiple accounts? Whoops. I didn't even get to click ready. Online. That's okay, I'm ready anyway. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems online. I'm trying to think if... Um, because for, for whatever reason, this is running a little bit framey for me today. And Ready I don't know if it's because I'm streaming. Affirmative. Affirmative. Um, it's kind of funny because I'm racking up Affirmative. stuff through, though, uh, through on that account that I can't really use with the trials at all. Yeah, so that's that's the, one, of the, one of the few things that was... I, I, I actually fully understand why they do that. What, like, you can't customize or gain skills with the trial max. Yeah, yeah. That's perfectly fine, um, but it 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 is a okay, nice Carl, incentive. Let's go and let them finish this one up. Okay, um, it's a nice incentive to actually get your own uh, lance of mechs and all that stuff to use. So they they really become your own. Okay, where where are my guys headed? I'll follow them. They know what's going on. I don't. <laughs> I should probably hang back, actually. I'm, a, I'm in a catapult. I should be looking for locks. Lock-ons. Got Artemis. Two LR, uh, LRM-15 Artemis. Two Streak, or Artemis SRM-6s. Trial catapult. It's not a bad mech. I did pretty good in it last time. <laughs> I kind of like the way missile systems work in this game. I think they, it worked out pretty good. 300 meters. That's good LRM range. Oops. Ran into a wall. Okay. So this one has around to the right, I see. Or two. Whoops. What did he whoops? Two hundred is minimum for the LRMs. Two seventy is the maximum for SRMs. Ah, okay. So uh, really, the SRMs are pretty good for uh, you know when people come in at you pretty close, obviously. Uh, They're spotting targets, and I don't see them. I do wish I wasn't being so frammy. If you dance back and forth 300, you can use both alternatingly. Oh, okay. That's a nice strategy. Target spotted. Okay, I don't see these. Oh, they're over here. Press B for a larger map. Oh, look at that. Very cool. Oh, I'm so framey. I can't tell if that's uh, an internet thing or a graphical thing. Uh-oh. My lance is under attack. Target acquired. Oh, my goodness. The frames. Lost my lock. New target acquired. Great. I'm the only missile launcher that can't uh, actually fire any missiles. So I'm a little further away than the 300. Press F9 and info overlay pops up in the top left corner with your current FPS. So the ping is low. But I'm, I'm dropping frames like crazy. New target acquired. Oh, he's 
got me. He's got me good. He's got me good. Strafe, strafe, strafe. Where? I'm by, completely by myself. <laughs> cool. Yeah, one FPS is pretty gosh darn low. <laughs> uh, so that must be... I mean, it, it, it must be a graphic thing for sure. <laughs> oh, 15. That's what I get an Office PC without a graphics card. Yeah, and and weirdly enough, um, they really actually, I might as well just stick around. Um, I It was running so much smoother, like even earlier today. Um, so I, I'm not sure... I'm not sure why I'm losing so many frames now. Okay, I guess we're exiting the match here. Quit match. I was trying to spectate. I thought I clicked the button. Let's go. Let's. We're gonna check out our. Uh, and it, it. I wonder. It could just be that I'm streaming it, honestly, but. Uh, Right, we're going to try to investigate here a little bit because that's, uh, I mean, I can't function at frames like that. Oh, well, that was a disastrous, uh, <laughs> a disastrous mission. Um, let's see, let's check our video here. Let's go to... Actually, let's let's do the advanced options here. Fax, ground, or of shadows. Let's turn the shadows down. Eh, let's turn the shadows down a little. Everything else should be okay. Yeah, that all looks good. Um. Spectate then doesn't switch to another mech if you hit that setting menu with escape before okay yeah so that's yeah that's what happened there turn v-sync off okay i'll give it a try uh motion blur is off that's good damage glow enables or disables glowing damage decals let's turn that off too Maybe that'll help. Everything else then I can kind of leave. Yeah, that looks good. Let's try that. Save. All right, I think we got time for one more quick, uh, quick match here. We're gonna take out our night gear for one last spin. All right, let's do it. Let's go. Let's get a win for our last mission. <laughs> I had a couple wins earlier. I promise I'm not this terrible. I mean, I'm terrible, but not not this terrible. I do tend to favor uh, favor 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 uh, ballistic weapons in these games. Um, I seem to have a lot more success with them. Uh, although the, my my only complaint. Is, is I wish that the gauze rifles would just fire when I click the button. I don't like the charging aspect of it. Um, they're still, I mean, I seem like to, it seems like I rarely hit with them too. <laughs> Requires a level of accuracy that I don't yet have. But maybe maybe if we get some frames back, we'll, uh, oh, look at that. We're up at 60 frames per second because there's nothing happening on the screen. <clears throat> yeah, I, I kind of figured that. Um, that makes a lot of sense, really, because God's Rifles, at least in Battletech, and... Uh, well, the, the tabletop and the, the video game, um, 
are very powerful, and they're still pretty powerful. Sort of playing Gauss PPC. I haven't, I haven't actually had a mech with a PPC on it yet. Um, do they charge as well, or do they just fire? got a skirmish they just fire oh okay they're they're still pretty well balanced i think even with that because the heat they generate is extreme <laughs> i imagine well they should anyway i mean mech warrior despite it being like a first person style game uh really does follow the mechanics of 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 tabletop battle tech Let's load up here. Load up. There we go. Ready. Destroy all enemy mechs. Gauss PPC is when you charge up the gauze rifle on one button, then time the firing on both weapons groups so that the PPC fires at the same time as the gauze rifle. Oh, okay. Sounds interesting. Sounds also very uh, powerful. <laughs> that's, a, that's a lot of damage to be coming right at you. Okay. It's about punching through a single component, preferably the head. Yeah, <laughs> that'll do it for sure. That kind of damage, too, would rip through somebody's uh, center torso with relatively ease as well, I would imagine. Depending on what you're shooting at. Is there a way to... Um, that was the other question I had early in the stream, is uh, this this arrow, I feel like I may have accidentally turned it on, and it makes me feel like a noob. <laughs> so I didn't know if there was a way to turn it off. The damage scale of a gauze rifle and PPC together is just right to take out the head component in one shot if you hit with it. <clears throat> yeah, I, am, I definitely can see that happening. Maybe someday I'll be good enough at this game to actually pull something like that off. I keep it on all the time. It's, I mean, it's its not the worst. Come on. Stymied by a hill. I think you can switch it off in settings somewhere. Okay. I thought maybe I, I panic hit a button or something. But it seems like, uh, like when I spectate, it does seem like a lot of people have it on. So I don't, I don't feel that bad about having it on. <laughs> oh, I don't know if I want to go down this hill. Oh, we did take some leg damage there. That's okay. It helps keep track of a lot when, yeah, torso twisting and such. Yep, for sure. Target acquired. Target spotted. Okay, we got dudes over there. To the left. Target There's spotted. one up here. New target acquired. But you don't really need much in tier five yet. I was all happy. I felt like tier five was a lot. <laughs> oh look, this guy here. Oh, he sees me. Critical damage. Critical damage already. Mostly my fault for jumping like an idiot. Go forward now. Okay. This is a bad position to be in. New target acquired. Oh, there's a guy right here that I want. Let's see if we can get up and hit him with a couple of ACs. Right in the back. going the wrong way. Run away. <laughs> oh, 
no. <laughs> so, my error there clearly was turning around and running away. <laughs> I should have just leaned into it. Shield from the guys in H7, H8, H8, yeah. That's true, I did kind of have some cover. It just, I looked at the map and it just, I saw a sea of red and it did not look, oh, I'm the only kill so far. Cool. <laughs> Take a look. Let's see. Let's, let's watch actual decent people play. <laughs> okay. So actually, uh, I am going to have to exit the match. I have to go be an adult. <laughs> well, that is going to do it for today's stream. Uh, but this was a lot of fun. I can see myself playing this for... For the long haul, I think. Um, uh, yeah, and uh, so thank you very much for joining me on this stream. Thank you for the advice as well. Oh, and thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. Thank you for supporting the stream. I much, much, much appreciate it, uh, as well as the sound advice. I've uh, <laughs> The other games I play, it's kind of the same thing. I start playing new games on stream, and the people that follow me... Uh, always make me a better player <laughs> so um thank you very very much for joining me and i will hope to see you soon have a great day bye bye